To the bear program, and now continuing the stuck and bear of the night with the Wellington uh, Wally Met Hawk volume seven. That's right. So, the first one was just uh, another word spoken, and now we're moving on to one of the classes, the Wally classes. Okay, so this is our tell best bidder. Okay, so I would assume the cooking out of the uh, well, they didn't take it out of the chorus line of what no, actually. They just, they just stopped painting it. So, now, after a popular demand, Wellington cave in and say, People, we hear you. And so, they bring it back in camp for a limited time only. And yet, you can actually go to the buoy and online, we can order a two four of this beautiful classic. Now, for those who are just joining the craft beer scene now, and you know, if you're from Guelph or whatnot, and oh my god, you know, just a hand on it. It is absolutely a classic. It is one of the better beers that you could drink pretty much all day, and not really like, you know, just move and, you know, balance it and. She just, just cried to this day. Anyway, so we're gonna get into the bad boy right now. Get into the, just a regular gap. You may notice that I don't have, well, actually, I do have the ones in the beer gap here. I just got the, the beer, uh, the dominant one, and then, man, I did have the Wellington punch glass here, but I don't know what happened to them. Maybe they broke. And the wife didn't tell me. So, I wouldn't be surprised, actually. So, this is our tell best better. This is 4%. This is the light beer. It's smooth, well balanced, and flexible. So, first brewed in 1985, our tell, our tell best better is an amber dusting ale with a mild caramel and bitter malt body with a full uh, hop in it. With only 4% alcohol by volume, this well balanced, and your style better is the perfect. Just an ale for any location. <clears throat> so, you can actually get it on Growler Phil, for a while there, and actually it kept going. And I know from my hometown, Peterborough, Peterborough, at uh, Perona on Hunter Street, actually have this on tap. So, you know, every once in a while, if I happen to be in the area, and oh man, I saw a bit of them, I had that in a while. So you can just go and have a fun. But again, you can get it at the brewery on in the Valley Field. So anyway, as you can see here, it's uh, obviously, uh, it's, you know, like a very uh, bronzy amber color there, very clear through, lovely off white hair. So definitely getting that bit of a uh, calm aroma there. Yeah, don't feel for that though. Here. That is smooth. I absolutely met our tell that bit to be honest with you. Maybe maybe we wasn't doing really well in the art of real. Maybe we're just making room for it, you know, the FDI IPA. Maybe, I don't know, but this is absolutely delicious and definitely well met for sure. But even though I had it on top at, you know, variety bars and at Wellington, right? So, but still, there's nothing about having it in a can and taking it home and just cracking the whole cold one. Instead of taking a growler, you know, sometimes you just want more of it, but but it then, though. And I'm really hoping that, you know, maybe they will some tune in to have this around. Well, maybe they even do it in story style and do a dip hat. I would love to have that, to be honest with you, though. So. Mm -hmm. So, at the body, it's a very light to medium mouthfeel. Very smooth. It's definitely caramel and malty. But you know what though? 
It's not bitter at all. It's actually, they feel like, man, this is a good beer. You know, damn, it's a good beer. There's nothing better about it. But it's a beer that can just make you even, ah, that's a beer, you know? Anyway, so, for our target bitter, this is one of the classes, and definitely cannot be missed, okay? So if you happen to get it in, you know, in this, or order it on and on, you can get a whole two for it if you want. You know, like, to have them, or buy the dinner, whatever you want to do. Like, you can just buy them by the flat at the brewery. So, this, that's a, that's a good beer. Anyway, cheers.